Okay, so I'm here in London with beautiful... Amber. And? I'm Monique. <laughs> Where are you guys from? I'm from Arizona. Okay, and? I'm from Melbourne. From Melbourne, Australia. Okay, lovely. How would you like the weather here compared to... Uh, <laughs> Australia. Yesterday was awful, awful. Yeah. It rained so much, we couldn't quite believe it. Um, but today is beautiful, so it's it's improving. Yeah. Welcome to England. <laughs> Where are you from? Uh, I'm from France. And your name is? My name is Amira. Amira, nice to meet you. Leo. Molly. How old are you girls, by the way? 21. 21, yeah. And you're from England as well? Yes. Do you guys prefer to date an English guy or do you prefer a foreigner? And if a foreigner, where from? Oh, I'm English. Sorry, I've got to be boring. I'm not bothered, to be honest. As long as obviously they're nice and not horrible, then it doesn't matter where they're from, so... What's more your preference? Like, do you guys like more Asian? I don't know. I'm the typical, like, tall, dark and handsome. So probably, like, anything that's, like, Italian or anything like that is probably what I'd probably more be preferred to go to. What do you think of foreigners? Would you prefer to date a foreign guy or would you prefer to date an English guy, since you're in, obviously, London? I wouldn't mind uh, dating an English guy. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't mind dating any, uh, any from any country. I don't have any preference. Don't have preference. No. Yeah. What about uh, guys from Asia? Then? You still like Asian no, guys? yeah, they're cute. Like yeah, cute. they're cute. <laughs> foreign men? Or would you prefer to date English guys? No, living in London. Well, I'm foreign myself, so yes. they would be foreign, unless they're Croatian. So, Croatians for sure. Yeah. Uh, British, yes, nice. Mm -hmm. I'm not quite sure I have a preference though. Right, so is it more about the vibe, how you get on the with the vibe. guy? Exactly. Right. <laughs> okay, so guys, do you prefer skinny, tall guys or short, muscular guys? I don't think I really have a preference. No. So you would date someone that's like five feet tall? Mm, maybe taller than I am, but taller than yeah. You. Yeah, but Yourself? that's not hard. Yeah, I'd go tall. Go taller. How yeah. tall though? How tall does it have to be? Like yeah, six yeah. foot, taller than five, taller than, taller than, taller than you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you guys prefer tall, skinny guys or short, muscular guys? Um, I don't. Probably tall and skinny, just because. Because I've, you can maybe put on some muscle. Yeah, I'm like because I like going to the gym and stuff, so I could probably get him to come with me and then build up the muscle that way, and then he's still tall at the same time. How tall though? How tall does he have to be? Well, I'm five four, so, so five, 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 seven and above. Five seven and above is good with me as long as I've got a little bit of height up there. Can he be too tall as well? Yeah, I think like if there's something like six eight, six nine, I think that's way too tall. Way too tall. You're gonna like break your neck trying to look up at them. Tall, skinny guy, or a short, muscular guy. Oh, well, I'm quite tall myself. How tall are you, by the way? One seventy-eight. Oh wow, you're nearly taller than me. I feel See? very small next to you. See, now. but if I wore heels, <laughs> if I wore heels, I'll have to walk like this with you. I don't know. Would that work? So, what's like the height are you looking for? The height. Um, 190 would be nice. 190? Yeah, that's... I'm failing then. Well... <laughs> <laughs> so would you date a guy that's shorter than you or no? You wouldn't? I wouldn't, no. Okay, so you'd always go for at least your height and higher, right? Well, and if it's my height, I can't wear heels and I like wearing oh. heels, so it has to be a bit taller. Tall, skinny guy? Okay. Or do you prefer a short, muscular guy? A tall, skinny guy. Tall, skinny guy? Yeah. Why are you tall, skinny? No, I don't like short guys. Why not? No. They're always like... Uh, I think they're, they're rude. Or maybe I've gone with the wrong short guys, but they're always mean. The rude? They're mean to you? Yeah, Why are they mean to you? I don't How know. How tall are you, by the way? I'm uh, 160 centimeters. Okay, so that's like... Uh, I don't know. How tall does he have to be? Uh, more than uh, 170. 170 plus. Yeah. Okay. If he's below that, then that's it. No. Oh, yeah. Bad experience. Bad experience. Yeah. <laughs> Do you guys care if the guy can fight? So, like, let's say if you're walking around the street and you see someone that's a bit dangerous, they come up to you, he beats up your boyfriend because he can't fight. Do you guys care about that or we're equal and it's, uh, no, it's fine? I don't think I would care. Or are you a fighter yourself? Oh, oh. I'm not really a fighter. No, I don't really like violence, so I think I'd prefer he didn't fight. Right. 
Yeah, you? I don't want him to start the fights, but I'd be oh. happy if he could end them. Would you date a guy that cannot fight? That cannot fight? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can fight. Oh, you can fight? I can fight you're for a fighter, the both of us, yeah. So let's say if you're walking down the street and you see a guy, he approaches you guys and he beats up your boyfriend. Do you Obviously. leave him? Do you stay with him? Obviously you want protectiveness. Protection. Yeah. So you want to be able to know that you're safe with them. Yeah. But then it's never nice seeing anyone in that situation anyway. And there was like three guys coming our way, yeah. right? And he's still going to go in there, but he gets his ass beat. Are you cool with that? Ooh. I mean, at least he tried. <laughs> yeah, but... So you prefer someone that can fight a little bit? Yeah, so I feel safe. You feel safer? Yeah. So guys, go to your jiu-jitsu classes, uh, do your Thai boxing. If the person attacking him is like bigger and stronger, then if he gets beaten up, then obviously that's fair game because the other person's a lot bigger. But if, mm, if he doesn't fight, doesn't matter. The question is, you still stay with him, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, of course. No, like he doesn't have to be a fighter, but if there's like an issue, like he needs to be able to like fight someone. Right. But he doesn't have to like fight everyone. Tell me something that your mom doesn't know about you. My mom? Mm -hmm. Most things. Doesn't so you're not know. really close with your mum? Well, close. We are close. That, that doesn't mean we don't share. You know, it doesn't mean we have to share things. So there are things that she doesn't know and she doesn't have to know. <laughs> what do you mean by that? I don't know things right. about her that, you know, I think that's, yeah. that's fair. Tell me one thing that your mum doesn't know about you. My mum knows a lot. <laughs> <laughs> She knows everything about you? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Yeah, so I'm quite close to my mum, but probably my body count. There might be a few that she doesn't know about, but that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> she probably knows. Yeah, she probably knows, okay. but just doesn't tell me. <laughs> you go first. I don't yeah. know. The reason the fighter question got me, I was almost mugged in Madrid when I was oh. there last, and the guy I was with protected me, so I'm like, so he was a good fighter. Down for that. Yeah, yeah, he was got he a, a Thai black boxer? eye out of was it. He a... Yeah, I think it was Muay Thai. Muay Thai. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, I went bungee jumping when I was 18. <laughs> right. She never found out about it. How much does a guy have to make to date you? Has to make? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. That's not, I don't have an answer. What's the minimum? So, so yeah. let's say if I'm unemployed and I'm homeless, are you still going to date me? Well, homeless and unemployed, homeless. no, no, I wouldn't. But I work and earn enough, so I wouldn't expect, I mean, it would be nice for him to earn his money and good yeah. money, yeah, but yeah, there yeah. isn't a number, I don't know. I'd have okay. to like the guy first, not, doesn't. Would you say, let's say if I'm a doctor, but I don't make that much money? Right? Is that more attractive to, let's say, I work in McDonald's, but I work like overtime and I make a lot of money? What's more attractive? More attractive, someone more intelligent. So, right. so I would status. assume as a doctor you would be more intelligent. Doesn't mean that you would be, but right. yes. So. If I was to take you on a first date, how much would I have to spend on you? Whatever you've got. Yeah, whatever you can afford is What's fine. What's the by most me? amount of money a guy has ever spent on you? Um, a couple of hundred, maybe? For a first date? Oh no, not a first date, no. Um, first date, probably like 80 quid, I'd say, probably. Around that, nice I don't dinner. know. Yeah, nice, nice dinner, steak. nice activity or something, and then... If I take you on a first date, how much would I have to spend on you? Oh. First date, though, not like a second <laughs> date first after we date. meet. Um, I think just a regular dinner place. Yeah. Yeah, maybe like... Above McDonald's? Yeah. No. Above McDonald's? So you wouldn't <laughs> no, want to go to McDonald's then? Somewhere where like, you can like sit down. Like yeah. a sit down restaurant. KFC? But not... <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, maybe like with a waiter. And like, yeah. <laughs> wow, that's the level. Waiter yeah. level. Yeah, waiter so level. So looking at, what, like 50, 100 pounds? Oh, not a Oh no, I, I would say like 20 pounds? Yeah. 20 pounds mm -hmm. per meal? Yeah. Yeah. Like that. yeah. yeah. So if he takes you on a coffee date, that's a no? No, that's a big yes. That's a yes. A big yes. Yeah. yeah, I think it depends on what the expectations were. Yeah, yeah dinner 20 mm -hmm. pounds, but like a coffee, a coffee is, is nice. Fine. A coffee and a walk, in. Yeah. Right. If I was to take you on a date, right, how much would I have to spend on you? On a first date. On a first date? Wait, you don't have to spend anything? Nothing. So just yeah. a walk is fine. We could go for a walk, we could uh, 
Yeah. We found a keeper. Yeah, Voice let's go. Well, we're going on a date now, so...